So everybody, welcome back to Power Court. I'm Disturbing Puppet, so we're going to continue where we left off, as long as it loads correctly. So we finished off the first boss and the first area, so we're on to the second one. We have all the default characters we started with. We haven't died yet. Uh, I'm assuming we'll unlock some characters once we have finished this run and kind of see how far we go. All right. Uh, we do have a little bit of people hurt, but I think we got healed up when we started. Yeah, it looks like we got everyone healed back up when we got back into here. Okay, um, we've got multiple chests here. That's pretty cool. There's actually three on that route. And we have a new boss I have not seen. The demo that I played before this only had the first boss. Yeah, let's take this route, I guess. We'll see how it goes. Got a new enemy, the Furnace. When these Scorching Guitars heat up their attacks, you're going to get burnt. So I'm assuming that they're going to have damage over time stuff. Bonesaw, Mad Science Singers will make it hard to knock out their band by healing demons and removing your charges. Okay, that's a priority target. Mechanic, Backing Singers have a stance for every song and follow up their band's attacks with improvements of their own. Okay, uh, so Healing Guy, I think, is this one, right? Heal one health on all allies that have no armor every turn. That's not great. I don't have a lot coming in. It's not too bad. How about... I'll go ahead and just set up... It's being kind of weird here. We'll set up Defender on her. So we can take those hits. Uh, I'd like to kill... The healer guy, potentially. Uh, Flamer Guy probably isn't great either. I'll put a barrier on Shinobi. We could drop some poison on somebody. I mean, they do have, like, their frontline guy is actually quite weak. So we could do that. Maybe we could finish him off because the poison ignores the armor, so it just goes right through. We could also target this guy. Uh, he might be the better target. Let's do that. I'm gonna augment Shinobi. We're gonna hit some random people. Okay, I didn't actually get this guy for any poison. So we stopped that attack coming in. Let's do some health damage, I guess. Place hit armor on taking a stance. Okay. Right. So this guy's increased damage for heat charges. So he's actually kind of like this guy. All right. Well, we have some issues. I could transfer debuffs, but I don't have any debuffs. At least I don't think that's a debuff. Yeah, that's the barrier. Okay. Well, I've got debuffs coming in, I think. Let's just try to get a kill, I guess. I feel like it's a bit of a waste to do seven to this guy, but we could just nuke him that way. We could also stop some attacks coming in. Well, we could stop one attack coming in. So maybe I should do that. But he's going to take it. It'll just get redirected because he's defending, so it's not a big deal. Um, I can almost kill him. Yeah, let's just kill somebody. And then we'll start working on the armor on somebody else. Quite a bit there, actually. So the guy in the back is doing follow-up attacks. Adding weakness charges. This guy's still taking bleed. 
well. We could nuke somebody. Let's try to nuke the healer here. And I could kill him and heal. That's not terrible. Let's do that. I can get a barrier out. Uh, I sure why not. And let's do some random damage somewhere. Okay. Well, that's a big attack coming in. Can we deal with that? As long as I can take out his armor. We could try for the random. So that would just be four if I did that. That's not that much. We can do seven. Uh, we can hit somebody randomly. We can hit some random. I've got too much random stuff. I do have a lot of actions. Uh, let's try some random stuff. Okay, so we're going to stop you from attacking. Let's try another random. Okay, we just hit him. Does give me some defense. don't have enough to drop this guy from making an attack which is unfortunate yeah the most I can do is seven I could do six between these two so we'll just do seven taking a big shot here though Well, we could one-shot somebody. Is there anything else I want to do? Actually, we have a couple one-shots, potentially, because they're both hurt. Um, I think he wants revenge, so we'll do that. Grimnir takes him down. And let's just crush this guy. Yeah. got 10 damage to a single enemy and discard a random card not really a fan of discarding stuff summon three random toxin cards that's kind of cool maybe uh, I don't have a lot of stuff for shinobi so yeah let's take that we have a gearbox critical pick every fifth card this character plays will do direct health damage Yeah, we'll take it. I think I'll probably put it on Grimnir. I tend to attack more with him, but that fills up all his gear slots. Pulse on armor playing something. This is what? Power charge when getting hit. That's what he started with. Mostly I'm doing damage with him. Yeah, we'll do that. <laughs> Double guitars back there. The spike. Vengeful drummers that cover the demons in thorns to make sure you'll grit hitting them. That's a bit of an issue. Demolition. Basis likes to set explosives on your band to tear the stage down. Watch out for their self-destruct. They won't be taken alive. Yeah, they really need to be highlighting some of this stuff a little better. So what is this? Once under seven health, detonates all demolition charges on both bands. Okay, you currently have 10. Yeah, that's a bit dangerous. <laughs> All right. Um, let's put a barrier on Shinobi. 
Let's summon some Toxin cards. Five Corrode, that eats armor. Remember that from the demo. Suffocation, three poison charges on enemy band. That's kind of cool. Um, so all of them could be poisoned. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Because that goes right through the armor. And I can add some more poison to somebody, or we can start eating away armor on somebody. Let's do the armor on their most armor. And I'm going to take some damage. She can heal up with attacks. At least some of her attacks. Okay, now they've got thorns, so attacks are going to do more damage. Back to me. Okay, a bunch coming in. Throw up more poison. What is this? Gonna be detonated this turn. What does that even mean? Is that gonna do 10 damage? I think it would just show me the 10 then. Yeah, I'm not sure. Let me... Yeah, we'll protect her. Yeah, all I can really do that's going to damage anybody is poisoning. Nothing else is really going to do anything. Alright, well... can play this. The thorns are going to be a minor issue. Let's get some more poison on you. I'm assuming... Like, this has got to count as a buff, right? Nope, apparently not. Okay. Arterial Bite isn't going to give me any health. But I can do some damage, but then I'm going to get hit with Thorns. Actually, he doesn't have Thorns, so let's hit him. Let's see how this detonation thing works. see anything that it did. Everything's hitting the guy in the back, that's fine. We could just blow up the guy in the back. That might be a problem, though. So he's gonna blow up and do 10 to everybody. So if I do this... And then we kill this guy. Okay, the thing's still here, so I'm assuming it's gonna switch and it's gonna do 10 damage to everybody on their turn. And then it'll hit me as well. Or not. What the heck? Maybe because I killed him too quickly, it didn't trigger? I'm not sure. Okay. Well, you're not doing anything, so we're actually in... It looks like good shape. don't have thorns, so we're all set there. Let's uh, do some random attacks that aren't going to be so random. Random attacks that aren't so random. And I'll just kill you. OK, 
Okay. Next damage, plus one for each energy to all enemies. This damage increase is retained for the current battle. So once we play it, it stays at that bonus? Or the X stays? I'm not sure. So whatever energy is, we just burn energy, plus one. Uh, five rage damage to a single enemy, gain five rage charges on a kill. Okay, so we'll use the current rage I've got. And then if we kill somebody, we get five back. Yeah, let's do that, if that works the way I think. So it'll get the rage bonus. So it's five plus whatever the rage is. It'll burn all my rage off and then give me five back. I think that's how it's going to work. All right, we've got a mystery. Scientific method. Oh, we've seen this before, I think. No, this is different. A gaunt figure dressed in a bloodstained lab coat offers you a deal. She insists she is a legitimate doctor for people and will heal your band for some coin. Unless you want to volunteer for an experiment, then you can have your health adjusted for free. Health adjusted seems like an odd choice of words. Pay 10 for a little health. Heal everyone 2. Um, are we have anybody down? Just 1. 20 for more. Heal everyone 5. Everyone's healed for 2 to 5 health. However, the max health might be reduced. Uh, we've only got one person that's hurt, so I feel like spending anything's kind of pointless, but we'll do... Grumpus. The legitimate doctor for people grumbles for herself about how boring the results were and wanders off. We'll have another item. Okay, bracelet of teeth. After taking a hit, add two power charges and one instability charge. I don't like the instability charges. So it just means I'll take additional damage. So I'm going to deal more damage, but I'm also going to take more damage. And when we don't... Like, we're trying to stay in this for the long haul, and we get whittled down slowly over time. I feel like that's bad. I can't really justify it that much. I mean... I could give it to him. He takes a lot of hits. He might be able to tank it. But he doesn't have a lot of attacks. He's only got, like, a couple really light attacks. So is that really worth it? I'm going to say no. I'm just going to skip it. Unfortunate, but that sucked. Is that a bomb? That looks like a bomb. The shield. Defensive drummers that will make sure the entire demon band stays armor up while you beat them down. Brimstone bomb. The countdown has started. In three turns, you are getting blasted, but if you can destroy a bomb, it'll blow up in the demon's faces. So, right, yeah, that's gonna blow up. He's gonna try to protect it. So he's doing something. Five armor to the band. Alright. Well. What can we do? I'm going to barrier you, rather than going defender. I mean, I still might defender. Let's do 12 to this thing. It'll cost me a bunch. Everything else is kind of random. I don't know why this is highlighted red. Let's see. Yeah, we can do some random damage to somebody, I'm sure. And we'll do some more just kind of random damage. Okay. I was hoping we might hit the bomb. Didn't work out. Okay, more attacks coming. So we need to do 13 to blow that thing up. And I don't have anywhere near that much damage. Other attacks are also coming in. I don't really have any defense either. Well, does this count as a buff? Six damage. 
Currently, it's going to do six. Okay, if I do this... Poison it as well. And I could do a couple more points of damage to it, but then we're just going to have to suck up hits. I think that's all I can really do here. Oh, we got a barrier. Okay. Uh, let's put a barrier on you. Yeah, we definitely want to blow this thing up now. I can't wait for it to do anything crazy. Let's do that. Okay, didn't actually do that much damage to them. A lot of armor here. Well, you can have some armor. It. Some cards. I can't really play much though. We'll drop some poison on the big guy. I'm just gonna keep armoring up these guys, so we need to kind of deal with that. Maybe I can kill him with poison. Do you have a debuff I could transfer? I don't have any way to save you from getting hit. My frontliner is taking a massive beating here. Nine to a single enemy, five and gain some charges. I could take out the nine attack. I think. Take that off the table. So she's only going to take two. I still have a lot hitting uh, Shinobi that I can't really do much about. That's going to increase the damage by one. I could get rid of that. Or I could put some poison on this guy. Drop the damage I take by a couple, we'll do that. Starting to get beat up a lot more here. Okay. We've got a six. And I can do some more poison on him, so that will kill him. So, start of the turn, he'll die. And I'm gonna kill you. I'll uh, give you some weakness, because why not? And do something. Or not. I mean, at least I get some armor by playing something. Yeah, poison takes him out before he can do anything. Yeah, Shinobi getting hit like that does kind of suck. Now I'm getting all my defensive stuff. Have some armor. Everything's so expensive. I'm just gonna do whatever damage I can. And could get a barrier up to yeah, why not? Alright, 
You're heading back to the front. Okay, let's boost Shinobi. Do the random damage. Takes that out. Take a chunk out of him for some healing. And that's all I can do. And we finish him off. Doesn't really matter, it looks like. Shadow image. Stance. Do one damage to any enemy when they hit an ally. That's kind of cool. Uh, rare attack. So this is for our singer. Deal one damage three times and add one instability charge to random enemies. Is that worth two, though? I feel like this is better for two than this. This will spread around a little tiny bit of damage and some instability, so it's a good opener. This is just generally good. I'll take the Shadow Image. Alright, shop. What do we got? I don't think there's anything I want to get rid of. Some stuff's kind of not that useful. Like, the style on, I don't think is that great. But if eventually enemies have tons of buff stuff on them, then it might be worth it. Um, yeah, that's fine for now. Okay, other stuff. Character deals plus three damage on all attacks and takes one damage each hit when attacking. No, no thank you. Gain one energy charge whenever four cards are exhausted by the player. We don't really have that many exhaust cards. Hide, redirect all attacks on self to a single ally. That's uh, interesting. One damage three times to a single enemy for rhythmic blows. Reverberations. Stance, gain plus one energy at the start of each round. Ooh, that's kind of cool. Let me play more stuff. Uh, swap corrosion and poison charge effects on a single enemy. So the corrosion just does armor, so we can turn that into poison, or we can turn poison into corrosion. Probably you'd want to use that for corrosion into poison eventually after you've taken out all their armor. Hmm. I like reverberations the most. Rhythmic blows isn't bad. I've got a lot of attacks for him though. Let's go with reverberations. Uh, hide is also somewhat tempting. But I think I'm going to keep my cash. I don't want to get my deck too big here. Got a couple elites here on this line. Okay, cleaner. Guitarist is screw with your plans by cleaning debuffs from other demons. So which one is that? Molten plates. Plus one damage per heat charge on this character to the attacker if they deal armor damage. Okay, interesting. I think it was this guy, wasn't it? Okay, we've got attacks at Shinobi. Not so nice. I'm gonna get reverberations. Oh, although I don't think I can do that and defend somebody, so I might have to switch. Um, we'll see how that goes. So we could try to ignore this guy's armor by poisoning him directly, or we could prioritize this guy. Or send me discard a card at random on turn start. This guy take cover. Makes a single ally guard this character while guarded. Gain plus two power charges. That's not great either. Yeah, I don't like any of this very much. Okay, I'm going to weaken you. Could go ahead and gain some charges, do some damage, or we could drop some poison. I wish I could do both. Um, 
Let's work on this backliner. Okay, is that discard I just had? All right, so you're going to cleanse debuffs from a single ally. We have a decent amount of attacks coming in. I might need to switch to defender here. Yeah, I think I've got to do that. All right, let's... Uh, I mean, we can stop some attacks coming in. But it's all going to hit one guy, so that's fine. Let's work on this guy in the back. I'm most concerned about him. Let me just die. Okay, a bunch of attacks at Shinobi. Shut down some of it. Yeah, let's just knock him out. Oh, he's actually guarded. Ah, uh, that's not good. Is he no longer guarded? Looks like he's not guarded anymore. That's too bad. Um... Nobody's going to take a beating here. He does have a shield up, but I'm not sure if it's going to go for the first hit. It's only going to block two, so that's why he's going to take ten, rather than saving it for something better. It makes sense. It just goes to the first thing. I'm going to get this up. And I don't have any debuffs to transfer, so we'll just do some random damage. Now I'm taking even more, because it hit the guy with armor, does damage back. But that did trigger his ability. Getting a little bit of counterattacks. Okay, that was a massive attack coming in, but it's been redirected to him. Uh, what is your deal here going Extra damage for the heat charges. You've got power. I need a way to kind of get rid of these bonuses that they've got. If I can do enough damage, I can take out their armor and drop them from attacking, but I don't I don't have much. We can hit somebody randomly and hope it works out. Okay, so we could do that and take him out. Let's do that. So it stops his attack. Still a lot of damage coming in. Um, let's get some cards. Got the armor to cover that. Let me armor up Shinobi. So we can do damage based on buffs. So I think that's only five. I don't know if this counts as one as well. So that would be six. But we take damage back for that. So I can hit him for four safely, but I can't do much else. So let's just work on this guy's armor because he's got the most, I guess. We'll just absorb the attacks and hope for the best. Guy keeps getting nastier. Once his armor's down, we can kind of deal with it a little better. I still take damage there because I'm doing that counterattack. That's not good. Okay, his armor's down, so we don't have to worry about that anymore, but man. 
Okay. I have a ton of damage coming my way. So I think... So I can eat him. Get some health back. And then I'll switch my defense to shoot. Definitely getting a lot harder here. Got a 36 attack. Yeah, let's just kill you. Bye bye. I have no debuffs to transfer. I don't have much here I can do. I guess we'll just uh, use some power. Him a little bit, that'll stop his attack anyway. And got energy back. Doesn't matter too much. I'm just gonna leave it. We'll just kill this guy. Anyway, I can heal. Kill him multiple ways. Let's just uh, onslaught. Yeah, kind of getting whittled down a little bit now. Okay, start battle with plus five thorns. That's pretty good. Um, yeah, I'll take that. I think giving it to him makes sense. Because we're redirecting attacks to him. Let's do it. <laughs> More gear. Tome of Necromancy. Restore plus five health when this character gets a kill. Huh. Okay. I mean, the person it makes the most sense on because of attacks would be him. But he's full up. We can change some stuff, I think. Like, I think we can take something out. Yeah, I think that's kind of weak. Let's do that. No, we lose the pick then. Okay. I thought we'd have the pick available. Uh, maybe we do. Let's take a look and see. Yeah, it's gone, so we swapped it out. Alright, either one of the events doesn't matter. Last secret of the Thunderfist. Passing through an alley, you notice a brick in the wall has the signal of the Thunderfist carved into it. Would they do that if it didn't mean anything? Boar, reveal the last of the secret Thunderfist. Take a spell card from the secret compartment. Do that. We get another Reverberations. Boar asks the band to look away and then begins to pound out a rhythm on the wall with his mace. The secret compartment opens and inside he finds a powerful spell card intended only for a Thunderfist. Too bad I don't really have that. Um, having two of them might be a bit much. Looking at how many cards I have. I've got most cards for um, Grimnir. I could use a couple more for her. Yeah, I don't think I really want another reverberations so I'm actually gonna skip it so no harm no foul uh, hoping for some healing we'll get some healing here if we survive this but we've got to make it through this first okay there's one of the healing guys in the back Shocking minion. Annoying little bassist that strike at your entire band. Alright. 
Yeah, so this guy, I think, was the healer. Yeah, one... Anyone who doesn't have armor, he's going to heal. This guy... So if he takes a stance, he'll gain armor if he's at zero. Wow, they're really going for my frontliner here. Okay, well, you can have a barrier. For sure. I could defend her as well. I start with some thorns. I get some additional thorns if I get hit directly, so I might want to get additional thorns first before I defend somebody else. Um, she's still going to take six at the moment. Let's poison this jerk in the neck. Could do a chunk of damage to somebody. Could do some random stuff. Uh, let's just chunk down his armor. And we'll do some random damage. Okay. Get some thorns damage. He's doing like a heal. Two to everybody. You're doing armor to everybody. How about we hurt you? Instability charges mean we'll do additional damage. Then we'll kill you. Still have a lot of attacks coming in and not much I can do about it. Kill you, so let's kill you. Barrier. You. Excellent. Okay, going hard for Shinobi. Let's take you out. Still eight coming in. Uh, we'll weaken you. And then we'll do some random damage. Okay, I can get some healing in. So, yeah, we'll do that. Might want to armor up Shinobi because he's looking a little weak. Let's try to get some cards we can use. Let's work on you. And random damage or poison. I'll just poison this guy for now. Okay, Shinobi's in trouble.
We could try the random damage. Let's see how that goes. Alright, not enough. I can stop his attack. We could probably stop his attack. Uh, he can take it, so really the one on Shinobi is what I'm worried about. So I'll take you out. Okay, big attack's coming in. Eleven damage. Jeez. Alright, um... I don't have much of anything here. Uh, we can poison you so you'll die. So that leaves the ten. So, I'm going to Defender. And we'll give you some charge. Get you in your shadow image. Counterattack kill there. I did take a damage on the guy in the back, though. I can never remember the name of the characters. It's Grimnir uh, and other stuff. All right, gain plus one maximum health if this character takes no health damage in battle. That's, uh, yeah, that's not bad. This would have been really good to get early on. Yeah, I'll take that. Um... I'll give it to him, just because I don't have much for him, and maybe I can try to protect him a little bit better. Alright, we've got some healing. Get some health. Uh, yeah, let's go 30 for everybody, maybe? Or we can go Shinobi all the way back to full. That's probably better. Uh, 30 for everybody, so that would be about 9 for Shinobi, so we'd be at 27. Yeah, let's just heal Shinobi back full. There's a raise the dead option there. I didn't notice until just now. <laughs> kind of popped up. The most metal thing of all. Raising the dead. Fight. Thief. Treacherous basis to will steal charges to keep you weak and build their own massive attacks. That's not good. He's not super strong, though. Um, there's a healer. So the healer guy is in the back. Attacks all over the place. I can't protect Shinobi from taking damage, which is unfortunate. Uh, I'm gonna try, though. Let's put some poison on the healer. Do some random damage. Okay, get a little bit extra poison there. Let's do random somewhere and see what that does. Okay, we take his attack down. I want to hit him again. It's probably not a bad idea. Or we could work on the healer. Let's work on the healer. Okay, I think we want to defend Shinobi here. Get that set. Let's 
Let's weaken this guy, because he's hitting everybody. Give you extra charges. And let's hit the guy in the back. Hey, poison got him. Okay. Hit in the front. Well, I'm gonna take a chunk out of you for some health. Gonna try to restore health to the band. Let's stop that. Got no debuffs to transfer. Let's uh, see what kind of plague cards we can get. Nothing great, actually. Uh, you can have some corrosion because you got armor, but nobody else has any armor. So I guess we'll just stack more corrosion. Okay, got a couple of them weak. I need something that does like damage to multiple targets. That would be quite nice. Let's kill you. Then I'm gonna kill you. I feel like you're more of a threat. Armor her up. All right. Can we kill you? No. I have no debuffs to transfer. We'll just poison. Switch defender here. Uh, I mean, I can't really do much. I'll put corrosion as well. It's not going to matter. Give some more charges to near here. Don't have any spikes up, so we didn't do any damage back. Yeah, we can easily kill you. Let's get some health back. And then we'll just kill you. Alright, fairly smooth. Took a little bit of damage, but we got some health back too. Okay, I probably should not get him any more stuff. Convert three rage charges into two power charges for a single ally. Uh, tempting, because it's free. I might take one hide. Like, that's not terrible. I mean, it is a little terrible. Because I'm often going to have somebody protected by the guy in the back. Yeah, I'm just going to take the cash. Alright, we'll heal everybody up. And we're on to the second boss. Karna and Bello. In the former Grand Hall of the Thunderfist, Karna and the Bello have stolen the stage. With earth-shattering roars, energy-draining, lightning striking down in your band, you'll have to decide if you can afford to let the Bello free from Karna's order. It's a packed house, and the only way the tower is by crashing. The only way to the tower is by crashing your way through a demonic audience of beasts and thieves. Well, let's do it! That's a big monster, alright. 
Karna, electrifying basis that orders her beast into attacks and drains the energy from your band. If the Bellow is defeated, she'll cleanse any debuffs and armor up for the second set. The Bellow! So, a massive vocal beast that attacks on Karna's orders. The Bellow will shake off any debuffs and go into a Sonic Frenzy if left without its master. So just who do you want to fight in the end? Probably her, not the Bellow, although he's really beefy. Okay, we've got attacks hitting all of us. Um, yeah, not a great way to start. Attacks are split, so fives and threes. Let's get a barrier here. We could set up the uh, shadow image early on. Might not be a bad idea. Yeah, let's do that. Because there's no real negatives to counterattacking, it looks like. So just telling me what happens when she dies, and this will probably be, yeah, when he dies. Yeah, I think we want to kill him first. That would be probably better for me. Probably. But I think that's going to be a lot harder than taking her out. Okay, so let's give you some charges. And... I can do a little bit of damage. Might want to save it for the counterattacks, though. Because this will burn the power that I've got. So I think that'll help. Yeah, I think that'll improve the damage I do when I get hit back. Um, so I'd like not to use it. So I'll just throw some stuff out there. And I've got no debuffs to transfer, so we'll just have to take it. doing three on those counters. Okay, not great. We'll have to get a defense up. Um, wow, 27? Holy crap. Um, Why is that so much? Why are you doing 20 damage to her? That's nuts. Why is that so high? <laughs> that's that's so much damage. Um, I mean, I'll try to protect you, I guess. Um, have some more armor, please. Oh, this is all bad. I'm gonna poison the big guy, I guess. Let's get some other cards, maybe. Uh, I'll just poison you both. <laughs> but this is going to hurt. I didn't counterattack there. Why didn't I counterattack on her? Uh, what are you doing? So you're going to heal don't like that. I can drop your armor and stop that. But we're in definitely a bit of trouble. Um,
Jeez, okay. Um, let's try to stop him. I don't know if I can. Yeah, it's a little short. Please hit him. Okay. So as long as one of them hit him, it would take him out of the attack. I'm currently defending, so I should be getting some armor back. But if I switch to this, I won't. So I'm going to stay. I didn't. Why did I not get armor back? Did it take me out of my stance? It kind of looks like it. I don't see that I'm defending anybody anymore. So you're going to add armor. I'm going to add thorn charges. I'm not a fan of that, really. I bet we take out your armor. I think she's going to be easier to kill here, it looks like. Let's go random. And we'll go for him. That's too bad. Um... some weakness on you as well, I guess. Yeah, I don't think he's in his stance either. Um, I'll give you some charges, I guess. I mean, I could do a little bit of damage instead. Okay, I gave himself a ton of armor. Yeah, he's just evil. Um, all right, you're going to force his ally to use Stormbeam Stance and add plus two barrier charges. Frontliner is about to die. Um, you can get some more health. can't do enough to knock this guy out of attack. I think I'm going to have to kill her first. There's just nothing else I can really do. Almost got her down, but then we're going to have to deal with the very angry beastie. Yeah, that's not great. Um, okay. I kind of need to kill her. And I can. So between the poison... Actually, I might not have even needed the poison. She's going to do extra damage because of the uh, instability there. That's going to make him a little grumpy. Trying to keep her alive, although that might kill me. No. No, she still got hit, even though we um, guarded her. Maybe it doesn't matter. Okay, we have a really big hit. So I can knock him out of the attack this turn. got to use that. Um, everybody's about dead. Let's 
Let's get a barrier up on Shinobi. And massive attacks coming in. So this would be six, because he's got four buffs. I've got no debuffs to transfer. Poison. Uh, I guess we'll do what I can. Give me some defense. And I'll gain more defense. Barely alive. Okay, he's going to armor up. Um, I can't do any healing, though. Let's get Defender on you. He's my biggest damage dealer. So let's just do damage. If I don't play attacks, um, I can play some stuff for cheap with him, so I'm reluctant to attack. But most of my stuff's going to be like Defender or something. Um, yeah, I'm going to hold off. It's back 30 again. Alright, so 6 coming in. I'm protecting him. You're fine. Poison. We increase the poison. And I can go even more poison. Let's just go tons of poison here and see how that works out. I don't know why he's taking damage. He's being defended, so I'm not sure why that hit him so much. Um, okay, we can give you that debuff. Let's hit your armor. None of this is good. Um, I think he's going down no matter what I do. If I give him armor, it's not going to help. I'm just going to go ahead and do the damage I can before I go down. Why didn't he attack? The poison. What? I wasn't really paying attention. <laughs> what? What? What just happened? Why didn't he attack me there? Uh, I'm kind of confused. Because he was going to attack, and then something happened, but I don't know what. Um, okay, we're just going to keep stacking poison on you then. Enjoy that. Um, in my stance. We could do 10 damage. A little bit of defense. Okay, another big attack. He's got debuffs, no buffs. You take six. That means that should keep you alive, right? Wait. It didn't actually give him much defense at all, did it?
If it redirects everything, I'll be okay. I don't think it will. Um, just gotta go for her damage and get some defense that way. It's literally be like nothing. So I'm just gonna keep stacking a ton of poison on him. Ooh, got a barrier. Okay. Uh, barrier on you. Alright, I think we might survive this. Okay, let's go with... So, not so random, random damage. Knock you out of your attack. We poison you up. We increase your poison. And we're heading here for the kill, so let's just do a bunch of damage. Not quite enough to kill him on his turn, but it's close. He'll be dead before he gets an action off next. Nice. Okay. Uh, let's... Yeah, I think you deserve the kill. Alright, Karna and the Bellow, done. So we get, uh, this is, these affecting everybody? Plus one ban energy, but card rewards are decreased by one. Plus five starting armor to ally ban, but reduce max health by five. Plus one energy charge to a random ally at the start of each turn. Uh, I could go with the crystal monocle. I think that's not a bad negative in exchange for the extra energy. So I'll take that. This is it. You've made it to Tower Sunnyrock. But the demons are here, and the show's already started. If you want to get your hands on the Chronocaster, then you need to break through the Demon King, Valak the Crowned. Alright, new rewards might pop up. Yeah, we got her back, so she came back. Excellent. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and end it here. Um, I will figure out what we're going to do. Apparently this is the last of the three. So this is like the final boss, at least it kind of seems like that. So race to the peak of Sour Sonoruk, and the Demon King has gotten here first. Necromancers, Rage Demons, and Demonic Totems block your path to the four-armed Speed Demon, Valak the Crowned. Mid versus depending on you grabbing the Chronocaster first. Alright, yeah, so we'll end it here. We'll come back next time and we will play through this last section. Definitely would like to get some more cards for her. Um, we've got an okay assortment of cards for everybody else. We've got extra energy now, so we're in a slightly okay spot. Um, but yeah, it was a little rough getting through that second one. So yeah, we'll come back next time. This has been uh, Power Cord. I've been Disturbing Puppet. Thanks for coming by. Hopefully, I'll see you next time. Until then, have a good one.